I have a confession to make. Finally. I have had occasion to discuss, for example, in 1978, when our founding father passed on, I remember very well, because we were on school holiday, and I was looking after my father's cows. And when around three o'clock we were told uh, President Kenyatta had passed on. I remember we hurriedly took the cows home. We ran, literally, because in my mind, I thought it was the end of the world. <laughs> and then, in 1980, when I uh, was preparing to do standard seven exams, CPE, that was called then. I remember very well when I went to, um, to do the exams, I was bare feet because, of course, that was the nature of the village life. We didn't have shoes. My father bought me my first shoe in 1981 from a Mr. Onyango on the street for 60 shillings because he could not afford the butter shoes. Why am I saying this? Today, as you can see, the gentleman who did not have shoes is sitting at the high table. with the son of the founding father. <laughs> so the confession I want to make is when you see some of us go to church and pray and lift up our hands, sometimes shed tears, make this or that contribution, it is because we cannot forget where God has brought us from. I beg you to understand. Some of us have more to thank God for than some of you. So please, I beg you to understand because sometimes you judge us harshly. <laughs>